And so I just want to encourage everybody to keep your eyes on Jesus. And the unknown is a part of the journey. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. yeah. Don't feel like something's wrong with you because you don't know it. You know what I'm saying? God knows it. It's amazing for, to me when you read scripture, a lot of times when the way you read it is really the order that you're going to receive it. Mm. You understand what I'm saying? Yeah. And, and I really think you have to learn how to trust him yeah. before you can really release the control that yeah. we talked about yeah. earlier. You have to. And I, I think it's so important that we focus on the relationship opposed to what we're trying to do. Mm. Wow. Right. Wow. Yeah. Because yeah. really it has to come out of the relationship. Yeah. Everything we do has to come out of the relationship yes. in order to trust them. And and when, you know, when you're asked what what did you do during the season of the unknown? I don't know about you ladies, but for me, my whole life is the season yeah. of the unknown. Yeah, I agree. <laughs> You know, when you think about life itself, you know, when you think about marriage, you've never been married before, you know, so it's the unknown. Yeah. Mm -hmm. When you have your children, it's the unknown, uh -huh. yeah. you know, yeah. and and really, I have over the years wished that God had a different way of doing it. Mm -hmm. um, yeah. <laughs> but but you really don't grow in the know. That's right. Wow. That's right. The growing happens in the unknown. Yeah. Wow. Well, that's good. You know? Um, yeah. And so so it's so important that we just we really get to know who he is and God's ways mm -hmm. and understand his character mm -hmm. and begin to trust in him so that you can follow him and not try to do it in your own strength. Mm -hmm. yeah. Because I think it's totally impossible to do it the other way. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You know, and I can just look over my life and in every area of my life, there's been an unknown, mm -hmm. you know, and, and, and I think you handle that when we talk about even we think about Peter when he was in the boat. It's, it's like as long as his eyes were on Jesus, yeah. Yeah. he was fine. Yeah. But when your eyes is when, when your eyes go anywhere else. Mm. Yeah. You're guaranteed to sing. It's not if you're going to sing. It's when you're going to sing. That's right. Yeah. It, it automatically comes with distractions, you know. And so I just want to encourage everybody to keep your eyes on Jesus. And the unknown is a part of the journey. Yeah. Yeah. Don't feel like something's wrong with you because you don't know it. You know what I'm saying? God knows it. I think my life is a series of stepping out of the boat. And not just me, but but all of us, because really, that's how we get to know him in a different way. When we, if, if, when I look over my life, I can see that God will call me into something new. Um, let's just say uh, singing with my brother, B.B., for years. And I got comfortable, started out a little nervous, got a little comfortable. And I was like, okay, this is what I do. And then God called me, hmm, the solo. Uh, now, wait a minute. I don't know if I'm ready for this, God, but you step out and you know what? I get to meet him in a different way. I get a different revelation. And then he calls you, oh, you know what? Now I want you to, to pastor a church. Oh, no, no. You got the wrong person, God. You got the wrong person. No, no, no. It's you. Step out of the boat again. Step out of the boat. Um, and, and I think he allows us to step out of the boat so that we can learn more about him. I think the more we walk through the unknown mm -hmm. and we see that God shows up, mm -hmm. the more we see that, I think it makes it easier for us, even though we the struggle's still real. Mm -hmm. We still have temptations, we still right. have doubts and all these things, but it, it makes it easier or it should make it easier to say, okay, God, I can trust you because we have history now. Yeah. yeah. And so like there are certain decisions that I, I won't, make again right because god can keep you and it's not because we're so good it's because the more we see him and the more we learn from him yeah the more we know we can trust, trust him. him and we also know that the older we get like i don't know about y'all mm -hmm. but i don't have the same kind of energy for the same kind of foolishness that oh, i did when i was in my on. 20s come on no, you know no, what i'm saying god, so some things i don't want to pay the price for i know it can take decades some of my stupidness Ooh, yeah, it took yeah, decades wow. to get me out of yeah. i don't have decades That's to good. make the same mistakes so i'm like oh, okay no, no. god wow. i'd rather 
weight now, mm -hmm. you know, it, and, and your weight may be five, six, seven, eight, yeah. nine, ten years. That's a lot better yeah. mm. than me having to suffer with, you know, Ishmael's and Hagar's <laughs> all over the place. You know yeah. what I'm saying? That's so right. my point is the the more we walk with him, the older we get. Mm -hmm. um, really, if we are operating in wisdom for real, yeah. Yeah. it should be easier to say, OK, God, I don't know what the unknown. I have no clue, mm -hmm. but I ain't got the energy to try and make it up. Mm. You know, so I'm going to choose to trust you again. So, that's wow. good. That's good. Yes. And I think that does happen with time, mm. walking with the Lord. But we're here today to try to reach as many young people as we yeah. can. Yeah, mm. they you can get there sooner. To, you don't have to make <laughs> no. You sure do not. You, you can grab it. Hold. That's you can grab right. Hold to it right Absolutely. now. Absolutely. Yeah. But and but accelerate you have your to time. Understand mm. that His word is true. Yes. yes. That's that's really it. Yes. We have to understand that what He said is that's true. Right. Mm -hmm. And that He's faithful. Yeah. That He can't yeah. fail. That's right. And that He's always right. That's right. Yes. That's right. He's always right. You know. Um, so learn from but, our but yeah, but definitely, <laughs> yeah, but definitely as yeah. you get older, um, you definitely don't have time. I, I don't no. have time for food. No, 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 no. Um, and, and you want to see him, you want him to be able to flow. My desire is that he's able to flow through my life unrestricted. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Because he's, it's because of his mercy and grace, yes. he's going to flow through us, right? right? But how much can he flow? Through? Yes. Mm -hmm. How big is that straw? How, how big is that straw? <laughs> how big is that straw? Yeah. And, and even when you get to the place of understanding that yeah. I know God says, uh, I know who he is, who he says he is. And you get to that, that, yeah. that place in life of being settled. Yeah. Um, it's a beautiful thing. Getting old is a beautiful thing. It really thing. is. Thank you, Jesus. <laughs> yes. And you look like you. Got yeah. yeah. Aww. <laughs> it's a beautiful thing. But but it, you never get, you're going to always feel fear. Yeah. You're going to, fear is going to yeah, always. Contend with it still, yeah. Um, you never get to the point, I don't think, at least I haven't, where the unknown is, where the unknown feels like the known. Yeah. Mm. Um, yeah. Very true. Right? Wow. Very true. So, and that's how you keep growing. And it's okay. Yeah. Because you get here and it's like, okay, I got this guy. Yeah. And he's yeah. like, okay, well, what about yeah. this? Okay, I don't have that. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> like, yeah. But, yeah. You know, but, yeah. but that's how he keeps pushing you. Absolutely. He keeps pushing the mark. And so wow. we, we don't want you to be afraid yeah. of the unknown. That's what the enemy wants. Yeah. To yeah. Yes. Or if you don't feel comfortable, comfortable with the unknown, that you must not be in faith there or you're you not go. trusting right. That's, that's good. not yeah. true. Yeah. The unknown is never comfortable. Yeah. Very true. That's good. Yeah. I don't think it's supposed to be. No. Yeah. No, Otherwise, not. we wouldn't have, we wouldn't need faith. Mm, you know right. what I'm saying? We sure. say, I, I, I have it, you know? Well, yeah, I think there were like a couple of years ago, um, I started like, I remember getting on like my first album and being like, okay, so I just need, like, if I just did that, then mm -hmm. I'm going to feel secure. Mm -hmm. And then you're like, oh, wait, 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 no, it needs to do well. Okay, so if it just <laughs> does this, then I'm going to feel yeah, secure. Like, no, 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 wait, that doesn't. No, you no, never no, feel no, exactly. You so, don't. Yeah. And yeah. I'm like, I think you I've seen don't. enough to yeah. be like, that, no. Yeah. <laughs> whatever whatever it feels that like. Is, secure, that yes. sense of like, now I won't have to embrace any unknown. Yeah. Now I'll feel a sense of security. doesn't exist. And the Lord being like, you actually want to do that so you don't have to depend on me at all. Hey. Hey, now you got I'm like, you. Oh, now you got you. Way yeah, out of me. Yes. Mm. I'm like, well, that sounds that like a so horrible true. plan, but, but I am. Yeah. Yes. But I am doing that. Yeah. To remain dependent on God, I believe it's what it says in the scripture. In Him we live, we move, we breathe, and we have our being. That's, I depend on you for everything. Even when I feel like I have something, you know, it might be I feel like I have a certain amount of resources. But still, even though I may feel like I have those resources, I have to make sure my trust is still in God. God, I'm still asking you for my daily bread, even if I have food in the refrigerator. I'm acknowledging that everything I have is from you. So I think when we continue to stand that mindset and that framework, then it keeps us in a dependency on um, who He is and not a reliance on what I have. At TBN, our mission is to use every available means to reach as many individuals and families as possible with the life-changing gospel of Jesus Christ. Thank you for helping make the gospel of grace go around the world. And it's because of you that partner with us that this ministry continues. God bless you.